You know, it's really tough when you have a tough boss. And we know people don't quit organizations, they quit bosses. But you've got to remember that you have some choices here. And always thinking about that concept of choice. First of all, find out as much as you can about this person's life and begin to see what it is that is causing them to be difficult. Is it because they're into power? Is it because their emotional bank account is overdrawn at home, perhaps? Is it because they're fearful for their job? But trying to find out as much information as you can. And then creating as close a relationship as you can with that person. Perhaps asking them to lunch and asking them to sit down and talk about maybe how you can do something to make it a little bit better in your workplace. And you know, if you take responsibility to say, how can I make it a little bit better? Sometimes that will break through that barrier of a difficult manager. The other thing to remember is a Lou Holtz quote that I share often that says, why is it that the people who need love and understanding the most usually deserve it the least? And I know it's pretty hard to love somebody who's difficult. But, you know, that's the time when they really need you to love them. And maybe you can become that person's champion in the workplace. And they will see that and respect you for that. So all of these things are difficult to do, I know. And it sort of lifts you up a level to be able to say, wow, I can choose to be kind. I can choose to love this difficult person. You know, the bottom line is, though, your other choice is if they really are so difficult and you've tried everything you can think of to do to help them become better, maybe it's time for you to ask for a transfer. You know, many times these managers have been promoted to a position and they haven't been given the training and the skills to be able to actually do that position. And so maybe it's time for you to just ask to be transferred or even to think about another job. And then if worse comes to worse, you know, you can get one of the books on leadership, on on good management. I've got several of them anonymously. Leave it on their desk. And at least that might make them smile.